After jumping off to a quick start with its COVID-19 vaccination campaign, Israel said it will share some of its vaccines with several allied countries. However, the move has raised questions over the intent, with allies planning to relocate embassies and diplomatic offices to Jerusalem. Our Che jung yoon reports. Can COVID-19 vaccines be used as diplomatic currency? To Israel, the answer could be close to yes, as it announced on Tuesday its decision to share its coronavirus vaccines with several allied countries. Though Israel emphasized that the vaccination must be given to its own population first, it said that there are enough vaccine stocks to transfer a symbolic number of immunizations to countries that have asked Israel for help. Half of its population has already received at least one vaccine dose. According to Israel's public broadcaster Khan, countries like Guatemala, Honduras, the Czech Republic and Hungary will receive Moderna vaccine. However, the distribution of vaccines is raising some controversy, as these are nations that have all provided strong diplomatic backing to Prime Minister Netanyahu's hardline government in recent years. They have already moved to or are planning to locate their embassies or diplomatic offices in Jerusalem. This is seen as a political gain for Israel as it seeks international recognition for the city as its capital, while rival Palestinians claim East Jerusalem. The action comes after the World Health Organization condemned some of the countries acquiring excessive vaccine stocks and urged donating them to poorer countries. Choi Jong-yoon, Arirang News.